So, uh, we just found out that when we played the other day, it was causing, um, there was like some kind of weird feedback on the microphone. Uh, so we're just going to start from scratch. We're just going to start over. Um, Adrian is pulling up Twitch on her phone so she can test to see if we are having the awkward sound again. Um, because, you know, if the sound's there, I don't imagine we want to play with the noise. But, uh, yeah, you're just going to take a moment. Thank you for your patience, everyone. I appreciate it. Well, go ahead and blow out the candle. We just got done eating a late dinner of cheese and crackers. And we also got um, uh, smoked salmon. Yeah, we had summer sausage, smoked salmon, and pickled ginger to go with it. It's good. You sure? Okay. There's no buzz. Okay. All right. So we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna try this. And ooh, new cuts. Okay, never mind. It's the same stuff. So, already yeah. Had. So we decided that it would just be best if we just started from the beginning, since the first uh, attempt at streaming the actual Resident Evil game was such. Basically, the audio was shot. So I figure. It's better to just totally redo it. Yeah. You can get a little closer. Besides, Kenny has a better idea of what to do now, so he's not running in circles. Yeah. This pandemic has spread faster than any disease in modern history. Coronavirus. Angry mobs are the city building. Authorities are bracing for more rioting I do like that they made, like, the, the initial footage... Uh, realistic. Uh, yes, real people. Like actual footage. CDC is quarantined the lower midwestern region of the USA. Commitment, honesty, integrity. These are the core values that Dr. Matt Gorkish, genetic scientist. Much genetic. Such science. Health. It's wow. this foundation that will continue to build a brighter future for all of us. I'm also having a glass of wine. Because Kenny said I could. Yeah, I still need to have my rum and root beer you since I don't have Coke. Me? Yeah, yeah, you can go make me a root beer with some rum in it. Because we don't have any Coke or, you know, Pepsi, so. You know what my friend Jonathan at work calls Pepsi? Pepsi. That's weird. I don't know why he just says anything about this. Dude, you need to lay out the soda. It's not good for you. I always lecture him about the soda. And he's just like, but I gotta have my peppers. I'm like, whatever, bro. Okay, where's the rum? Why is the rum gone? If anyone gets that reference, I love you. Um, I'm, I pretty much guarantee they get the reference. Okay, just woke up from a bad dream. We're going to go ahead and start hobbling around. As one does. Or, well, I guess I'd... Umbrella? Question mark? I never noticed that she had this um, big old thing here before. Yeah, we don't have the knockoff milk here. Or, not the knockoff milk here, but the knockoff uh, Dr. Pepper's. Of all the sodas out there, I like Dr. Pepper's most. I agree with you. Dr. Pepper is best soda. But again, I tried to lay off the soda. Cannot justify the calories that soda has unless there's alcohol in there. Just saying. <laughs> <laughs> I have to get the thing out because it's not coming out. 
Yeah, our new neighbors are nice. Uh, uh, I let them know hey, if they needed any help moving things or anything like that, they can just give me a call. And we also invited them to uh, dinner. Of course, after this whole virus thing blows over. You like some ice, honey? No, no, the soda's cold enough. Okay. I appreciate the offer. You know, I don't blame the character for freaking out. Why does she have a picture of a dog on her desk of, like, Three more days. suspicious it's things? Here you go, honey. You just go ahead and put it in front of me. Oh! Really? Oh, cool. I didn't notice this when we played the first time. Well, it's a good thing we're playing again. that there's enough wall space between the couch and the wall for me to sneak behind here so I don't have to interfere with the microphone cord. It's fun. But yeah, no, it's really cool that she's got her little little board of paranoia here. Yeah, that's it. What am I sitting on? I don't know. What are you sitting on? Oh, it's my hairbrush. That's probably not comfortable. No. By the way, if anyone needs any good hairbrush recommendations, the Wet Brush brand is amazing. Uh, Kenny is currently using the one that he broke when he was trying to use it as a uh, makeshift hammer. And the reason I can't use it anymore is because my hair was getting stuck in the cracks. It wasn't cool, man. I'm still annoyed that she legitimately just had her water running this whole time. It's so wasteful and annoying and stupid. I will say that it's an unusual spot to put your nail polish, like, right by your sink, if you're a woman. To be fair, she's a special agent. I don't imagine she puts nail polish on all that often. I see it there. Yeah, I know, but that doesn't mean she's regularly putting it on. And an open compact of uh, facial powder. Just saying. Mm -hmm. Who could that be? Oh, we're look in the fridge. What's in the fridge here? Any woman who wants to conserve the integrity of her makeup will want to keep her compact closed until she's, you know, ready to use it. Because dried up makeup products is not cool. Is that a nice just right, distribution of uh, booze to soda? I would say it's pretty good, yeah. Good. Yeah, I'm gonna booze you up tonight. Yay! Hello? I mean, I don't work tomorrow. It's okay? nice. Thank Brad, God. Is that you? Listen, it's easy you for you. What are you talking yeah. about? Lucky for you. You gotta get out of there right now! Alright, let me grab my... I have to let me grab my... Oh. I have to work a 10-hour shift tomorrow at uh, Taco Bell. Taco Bell. Bell. And uh, honestly, those of you asking me how I'm not working as a phlebotomist yet, it's because the state of Washington is taking their sweet fucking time giving me my phlebotomy license. I had my certification because I passed my exam and got a really good score. It's just that I have to submit all of my information to the Department of Health with uh, Washington State to get my license to do it. And like I said, they're taking their sweet fucking time with it. And, also and again, I still think it's the reason they're taking some of this time is that everyone's kind of crazy busy with everything going on. People. Oh yeah, oh yeah. And honestly, they were taking their sweet time even before the pandemic really exploded. And my instructor in my phlebotomy class did advise me that it was going to take several weeks before they actually like finished processing it at all. No way. Oh, fuck. Oh, yeah. Still with me. 
crawl! At least it's not like... Remember when I was playing the evil within that one time and I just started screaming, oh, Hobble, you son of a bitch, Hobble! Yeah. I still... I actually still need to play that game. I've only ever played the, like, beginning of it. Mm -hmm. I really like the seamless transition between the gameplay and, and the cutscenes. Yeah. It's really cool. They really are doing a fantastic job game-wise involving that. Oh god, when Final Fantasy VII Remake finally gets here, I mean, I think you're gonna think that game is gorgeous. Okay, see so. It's not scary, but it's pretty as hell. And, um, like I told Kenny, it's kind of a blessing in disguise that they took so long to get into my license. Uh, for phlebotomy, because honestly, I feel a lot safer working drive through only at Taco Bell than I would like being in close proximity with patients that could possibly be infected, infected or carrying the coronavirus. Well, hence infected. You can be a carrier and not necessarily be infected, honey. Ah, uh, yeah, I suppose that's Jill? fair, but Over here. Right. since then the. Uh, company okay? that provided me with what my HIV AIDS certification that right I had now, to do did you uh, and email me. me and they said that they have a new course Just for pandemics and uh, coronavirus um, procedures so uh, when I have another day off when I'm not working on my content I'm definitely what going to, always leads to uh, take that course it's probably going to be a few hours if not, just one hour. <laughs> hey! Hey, wait! Down here! Honestly, my HIV AIDS oh, course was really, 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 really brief. It said it was going to be like seven hours, but it wasn't. Brad! Maybe what they meant is that it was going to be like seven hours worth of training. In here! And not actually like seven hours of me so watching many. crap on a computer screen. <laughs> Bar Jack. Fucking idiot. Do this. Door behind you, go! But yeah, so that's why I'm still working with Taco Bell. Don't think about it. So I will say, I am surprised that those doors aren't. I mean, they just keep bouncing open. You'd think they'd have some kind of closing or latch. Mechanism. Like I'm sorry, Brad. I'm sorry, Brad. Okay, time to take this dude's gun. Sorry. Ugh. Kind of huh? It's a zombie game. I still think it's that those zombies came through way too fast to be like, oh, I'm gonna come after you. Bitch. We're just gonna save the ammo and avoid that zombie entirely. We're gonna crawl through here. Again, I like that Jill in this game is dressed a lot more reasonably. Yeah, yeah, but you know, I will say I probably will do a playthrough after I've beaten it the first time of her in her original costume because why not? Oh, but I think after you beat it, you unlock her costume from the uh, the very first Resident Evil, which, of course, I picked that because Jill is boss. The parking garage isn't far. I can tell you. The only safe place is in here. Yeah, I don't know why you think that's your only safe place. I actually might be tempted to have some tequila and uh, knock off Fanta. That's not knock off Fanta, that is Fanta. It is, it is Fanta? Yeah, it's Fanta. Why the fuck are you saying Fanta? Because it's, it's Fanta. I've always heard of Fanta. <laughs> but I guess that's just, it's just me being a, a dirty white guy. <laughs> Ah, 
Oh no, it's a zombie. Thank God he just fell over like a rag doll. Shit. Oh fuck, I thought I did the dodge maneuver. Get through, get through. Do it. Oh, I, oh wow. That bite effect on the fact that it's still on her neck, that's awesome. Yeah. Yeah. I'm really glad I went ahead and made the purchase and bought this. I'm glad too. Kenny did warn me that with the next couple of video games that he was going to be purchasing, that he was going to be playing them a lot. Yeah. See, this one, this one, I'm I'm saving specifically to play with Adrian. The other one, Final Fantasy VII remake. I mean, she can she can watch me. But that game's all about just my my nostalgia trips. You know? His nostalgia trips, his enjoyment. If she loves it too, then I, that makes me happy. It's just she won't have the same connection that I do because of the fact that she, she's not not only played the original, but she's not even watched me play it. No. So. Star, oh, God damn it. Although Kenny did show me uh, Shadow of the Colossus, and I fucking love that game. Oh I, yeah. I obviously, I've not played it because I'm a fucking idiot when it comes to video games. So. Shadow of Colossus is—it's gorgeous. It's just such a pretty game. And that's why you wear your seatbelt, bitch. Yeah. Should've worn a seatbelt. You wouldn't be going through this concussion right now. And coughing up blood, potentially. Oh. Excuse me. Which is something that I do often because of my severe allergies and my borderline anemia. Cough blood? Yeah. Oh, cough blood. I've, I've done it before. My allergies were really, really bad when I was still living in Yakima. Like, I would cough up blood because my blood vessels in my nose would constantly break. And then... Fuck this! You know, I, I call it up. Hey, easy lady, I got you. Who are you? What are you doing? James Carlos, and I'm saving you. Come on, let's get you someplace safe. Watch the hands. Watch the hands! 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 <laughs> oh my god, that was so funny. I'm sorry, Kenny uh, referenced uh, Buffy the Vampire Slayer when Evil Willow was. I think we're in the clear. Being all. I hope so. Gropey and We've normal Willow. Here. Hands! Yeah, well. Hands! My guys have converted some subway cars into a shelter. It's safe. I'm fine. Personal space. Okay, I get it. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, come on. Who's the dipshit that closed this? Sorry, we're gonna have to go around. Hey, what do you know about that monster? Nothing. I've never seen anything like it. But it's no zombie. It knows what it wants and won't stop till it gets it. Don't you like that in a man? No thanks. He's all yours. No thanks. I promise you're in good hands. I'm with the Umbrella Biohazard Countermeasure Service. BCS for short. Are you kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me? You guys are the ones who caused all of this. Whoa, 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 whoa. What are you talking about? You don't have to trust me, but I'm going to the shelter. You coming? Come on, it's this way. Uh, gotta love those people who just randomly dislike videos for no reason. They put another dislike on my couch video, and then they, and That's then I got three more dislikes on my last absinthe review. Yeah. Carlos. It doesn't bother me, but it's engagement on my videos, so I don't give a shit. 
She is an elite operator. I've, I've had to I repeat these do a couple dislikes on videos service. lately myself, but that's Our probably because I've been watching so much YouTube lately. Bad. It's like I'm coming across more it's things Jill. I dislike than usual. Nice to meet you, Jill. It's so funny because even when you dislike a video and even when you unsubscribe, unsubscribe to a channel and you specifically see the videos popping up in your recommended videos and you specifically hit the button that says, I don't want to see this, they will still recommend it to you. The algorithm is so fucked up. Drives me nuts. Also... My, my platoon has uh, suffered YouTube has been fucking with my subscription Just like notifications because several people have complained that they haven't damage. gotten notifications for my video well, uploads and that pisses me off. Yes. Well, we are doing all we can. If we can get like this one girl, I think she lives moving, in Belgium and she's a really like loyal watcher and I really appreciate her so much because she's so sweet help. and she's awesome. My man but, cannot do this alone. Uh, she said, oh, I didn't get the notification for this because I've had to basically periodically check your channel to see if there's any new right. videos. And then I told her, oh, hey, well, make sure that you hit the subscribe button, make sure you have the bell selected for notification. She says, I did, and I do, and I still don't get notified. And I'm just like, fuck! Thank you, what else am I supposed to do? All right, super right. cop. Here you go. We can use this to stay in contact. I know what a radio is. First things first. We need to get you geared up. Head up to street level. You'll find supplies there. All right. It's not Fanta. It's Sunkissed. Really? I could have sworn I bought Fanta, but oh well. I mean, I've had this soda in the fridge for a long time. There's like there was a sale on buy one. I'm pretty sure it was uh, in the fridge when we were living at the previous place. Yeah, it was like buy it was buy two get two free and quite frankly I don't drink much soda. So mainly I bought it for guests and when I occasionally yeah. have mixed drinks. Working on it. That's one thing I And how do I do that? Let's start by restoring power. That he will do that. Not gonna lie though, Kenny is very in touch with his feminine side. And it's fucking awesome. Girls, get you a man who's in touch with his feminine side. Okay, we're survivors. We've gotta get that train moving. Okay, there's a zombie there. knew you weren't dead, you son of a bitch. <laughs> the only thing that would make that uh, tequila and Fanta better would be a little bit of uh, grenadine. Someone making fun of the. I'm not, I'm not gonna look, babe. There's a zombie coming. In. Okay, I'll wait. Ooh, head explosion. Good shot, honey.
Carlos, I've reached the main avenue. Which way do I go? See a big transmission tower? That's the substation. You'll have to circle around through an alley to your right to get there. You mean the alley that's on fire? Maybe. I'm sure we have a tall drink of water like yourself to put out a few flames. <sighs> Fuck you. I like how they kept some of like the awful 90s line, like one-liners. Mm -hmm. see if those zombies would actually stay dead or because I killed a couple of them before okay so yeah so even if you destroyed those ones they still come back all right Jim's Big Tuna. I tried making that joke uh, the last time, but because of the microphone audio issues being totally shot, you guys didn't hear it, so I'm repeating the joke. And Kenny liked that joke. Okay. Hey, Big Tuna. Fancy box. Fancy box. Oh my god, it's a panty box! Which reminds me, where is Miss Precious? Probably in the bedroom, still waiting on food. You want me to go feed her? Maybe you want to. Is he? Appreciate that. I found the baby precious. Love you too. Oh shit. I'm a little snuggly. Oh, head splot. Nice job. I'm a little snuggly because I'm a little drunk. No but judgment. Of, but of course, Kenny is just naturally just so snuggly. He is one that is easy to snuggle. So is Precious. There we go. So I 
need to get that fire hose, but I have too many items to do that. I wonder if that one company that does like Lord of the Rings inspired stuff is still making the uh, Witch King incense burner thing. Well, I wonder. I'm gonna look it up. It's piqued my curiosity. Because Kenny and I love Lord of the Rings. We do. It's one of the things that brought us together, actually. No shame. That and the fact that I knew that uh, in, you know, the book Hannibal, well, even the, basically I knew about Hannibal Lecter having an extra finger that none of the movies or television shows covered. And I was impressed by his knowledge of that. Yeah, she was just ecstatic that I knew these things. Because it meant that I read the books, I didn't just watch the movies, you know? Oh, yeah. I mean, as much as I fucking love the movies, there's just so much that the movies either leave out or change entirely in a way that's not cohesive to the story. Though Kenny does object to the end of Hannibal the book. Yeah, the the Hannibal book ending sucked. In fact, we discussed this on our first date. <laughs> You have to admit, though, the Hannibal ending in the movie was not much better either. Eh, at least she didn't end up, you know, with Hannibal. Oh, nice try, asshole. Nice try, dickhead. No! Son of a bitch! I was trying to back up and I couldn't. Oh my god, they have a golem plushie. Not too much of a surprise. Oh, hi, Precious. Oh my god, it's Precious. Hi, honey. Come here, honey. Oh, I should be better than it was right nine, or left nine, right... Left nine, right three, left seven. Yeah. They, okay, it's good to see that the code doesn't change. Thank god. It's not randomized. Well, they don't have the uh, Witch King incense burner anymore. That sucks. What did you say? Precious keeps headbutting me. She's expecting some love. God! Son of a big, filthy fucking zombie. Okay, I'll let you come through the door.
Oh, she's Oh my god, it was so cute! Precious, I can't take it. I'm sorry. You're just so damn cute. zombie. Oh right, I still don't actually have the fire hose. I'm silly. Whoopsie. I need to make space for the fire hose, though. I could have sworn I saw you pick it up. Well, no. You dropped it off somewhere. No, what it was is I I found it. I just didn't have space to carry it. Oh, I get it. Oh, I get it. Oh God! I didn't see him. He was sitting in the dark. Piece of shit. It's okay, honey. It happens. I apologize for the, all the yawning guys, but when you combine my ADHD medication with alcohol, it tends to make me sleepy. Toy uncle? That sounds creepy. Toy uncle. It does. It sounds creepy, doesn't it? Mm. Tell me that doesn't sound creepy. I mean, it could be worse. Gotta put this out. There. Oh, she's into that purr. I wish you guys could hear Precious purring because she's being very sweet right now. She's a sweet, precious kitty. There's someone in here. Oh, fuck. So what I'm gonna do, if I'm not mistaken, the red gem... The gym, details on this is fucking great. Yeah. The fact that you could see the door, the, rather the shadow of the gate, closing behind her... Yeah. ...was amazing. I dig that so hard. It's the little things, right? Yeah. Precious, that's my hand, not your ear. There she goes. Oh, cool. See, what I'm doing is I'm trying to... There, there's an achievement for never using the... Um, 
item box. So I'm kind of sort of using, trying to do it. In case you want your cat face. It was. I very much enjoyed it. I was at first scared by the idea of smoked salmon, but because, you know, when you look at smoked salmon in the package, it doesn't look like it's fully cooked. Right. And then when you eat it, it's just like, oh my god, it's so good. Delicious. So let's True. go get my fancy pants shotgun. Not just your shotgun, your fancy pants shotgun. Oh, little Missy is loving the pest right now. Precious, unfortunately, is still in her kind of hiding phase uh, for the moment because, you know, we moved into this place about a month ago. Nice head explosion, honey. Oh, yeah. That's what she said. <laughs> <laughs> it's weird. I don't know. It just came to my mind, okay? Why would you say that? It was... Wow. Okay. So what we're going to do... I'm going to use a hand grenade... Now I'm just gonna blow the shit out of these zombies over here. Because they suck. <laughs> Make sure they're nice and dead. Oh, fuck. Well, apparently I didn't even use a handgun or a hand grenade because there's a whole explosive right there. Whoopsie. On the plus side, those guys are definitely cooked. Oh yeah, they're fried. Okay, now there's some pistol ammo that I wanted to. Uh, well, gunpowder I should.